Hi, I'm Raf and I'm going to be interviewing Ruben and Alex on their experience with the Japanese visitors. Um, Ruben hosted and you toured, didn't you? Yeah. So, what, what did you learn from this experience? I learned well, more Japanese. Yeah, same here. And I learned a lot about the Japanese culture, which is... Uh, and yeah. we did origami and stuff. Yeah. Have you had an experience like this before? Well, I yes. uh, I toured one last year, but I didn't like host one. Didn't sleep in my house like you did this year. Yeah. Oh yeah. And would you like to host like one one year? Yes. Would you? Yeah. Host one next year. Next I'm definitely year. gonna yep. try again next year. That's good. Um, and when they slept at your house, was it like was it like a bit different or was it the same? Like. Well, it was really weird. Um, because at meals. You, I got this translator and I tried to explain what the food was because most of it was Australian food that he yeah. probably had never tried before. And sausage. he would have, uh, no, there was more than sausage, yes. Yeah. Um, but he, it was just very awkward at meal times and long journeys and stuff because we couldn't really talk to each other. But we, we got, we had a, like a good friendship by the end of it. That's good. Yeah, I think he improved his English as well. We yeah, same with my kid. Yeah, were you keeping contact with them? Well, probably. I mean, he left Maybe. his email and his address so I can write to him and email him awesome. stuff. Yeah, awesome. Thanks. Um, so, how did you become interested in like setting up the Japanese students coming here? Okay, so um, the Shire has a relationship uh, with... The, so the Mayor has a relationship with Tokai City as a cultural exchange. Um, and about four years ago, they asked us um, or asked all the schools in the area whether they'd like to um, take some students on. And Braemar College was the only school who said they wanted to. And so since then, we've been hosting them every year. So. And um, like over the years, have you learned any... Japanese culture. Um, oh, I've learned a lot about culture. Um, my English, but language, no. Um, I've struggled to pick up the language, but um, but lots about their culture. So every year they put on a cultural show. So over the years we've had um, music and dance and storytelling, um, games. So and so every year there's something new and it's always lots of fun. Yeah. Do you reckon that the students appreciate? like the Japanese students coming and then they're learning some of their culture. Yeah, so one of the things that our students use, is, as, as you would know, is Broma um, is not very multicultural um, and so it's great to be able to have that opportunity to meet students from another school um, and they learn and in the year eights especially they um, do um, one of their English books is uh, Japanese background and all the history that they're doing at the moment and religion is all to do with, with Japanese religion so it fits in really well with the things that they're doing and they really appreciate it and um, lots of uh, friendships formed and um, the students really really enjoy the, the opportunity to meet students from other overseas. I'm here with Alice Taylor to talk about the Brahma dress up today. So Alice, was the day successful? Yes Lucy, the day was very successful. Um, it was a very well run competition, very smooth, very fast and it was a fun day and Brahma won overall so that's always good. How was set up and pack up? Um, set up was on the Saturday. Yeah. And people were given their own little jobs, so a lot of them were setting up the arenas. And yeah, got done very quickly. That's always good. And then that was exactly the same with pack up. Like uh, a lot of people came and yeah. So, did you expect to win? Uh, not really, no. Not with the biggest track record in athletics. Um, and did you enjoy the day? Yeah, especially since it was the last athletics, it was pretty fun. <laughs> How do you think the athletics day went overall this year? I think it went really well, Raf. Um, we had great participation rate this year. We had 25 records set wow, and cool. we had a very close um, competition. So it was good to see Baker come up um, through the ranks and get a win. Uh, Baker haven't had a win in athletics for a long, long time. And then uh, for, the fo for the other houses, it was really good that they were only um, a few points separating each yeah. house. So it was a really close competition. So um, it was a great day, really good, uh, really good particip participation rate by all students. And it was really good to see the relays so close at the end of the day with um, lots of finishes coming down to this, the cross the line with the new timing gate. Oh yeah, awesome. Thanks, Mr. Ellis. No worries, man.